Hi, I'm Charles Leclerc. I am a Formula One driver driving for Scuderia Ferrari HP, and today we are going to design some helmets. Charles, do you have a favorite helmet design that's been worn by another driver? Oh, good question. Um, I really loved the helmet design of my father. Uh, just a very simple design, uh, old school, but this I really liked. However, one of the most iconic design I think in F1 history, and I really like it, is Elton Senna's helmet. Yes. Just yellow and with the two lines, very easy, but uh, looking great, I think. You've had quite a few helmet designs over the past few years. Is there a favorite one that you have? I got to a place where I'm really, really happy with my base helmet. I think it looks great. It's uh, lots of red, of course, driving for Ferrari, it makes sense. Um, so I really like the way the, the helmet of this year is. Um, it's not too complicated, not too many colors. However, there's another one that I have to choose in the special ones. I will go for last year's Monaco helmet. I did my okay. colors, red and white, together with the pattern design of my father's helmet, and it looked really, really cool. So uh, this one was uh, one of my favorite. So the helmet design process, can you talk me through it? How involved are you? I'm lucky to have a great team behind. I've got uh, Adrian Pavio and a BS Design that is taking care of uh, the painting and the thinking about behind, behind every helmet. However, I like to be, um, uh, to have some implications on it. Obviously, at the first time we worked together with Adrien, I had to explain a lot of what I wanted, what I liked, and then now it's a few years that we work together, so it's a bit smoother. But I always have an input in uh, which color do I want, uh, if I want to change uh, something, if I have an idea, I can draw, draw quickly on my iPhone, it never looks really good. But then as soon as he uh, received the, the helmets, he makes my, my ideas a reality and uh, he makes it uh, look very good. Awesome, and how long does the um, helmet design process take? If you, if you had an idea for a helmet today, how long would it take for it to be, a, for it to be on your head? Oh, I'll say five, four, five months. Um, really? Obviously when you get to Formula One as well, there are quite a lot of, uh, there's a, quite a lot of discussion with Ferrari, just to make sure that everybody is aligned in the vision that we have of the helmet and that uh, it makes sense for, for everybody, that the sponsors are happy and everything. So I will say that this is what takes most of the time. The designing in itself, I'll say in a week, we managed to go from scratch to something we are very happy with. Now that we've got the uh, helmet designer in front of us, I'd like to talk you through how it works and then we can get you designing some pretty cool helmets. All right. So um, using AWS Party Rock, we've created this tool that allows you to describe your helmet in as little or as great detail as you want to go into. And then we can instantly get a, um, an example of what it's going to look like. Oh, all right, let's go. I'm excited. Awesome. A retro design with a small touch of baby blue. It's my favorite color actually, that I've never really used on a helmet until now. Why haven't you used it on a helmet? I will probably start next year. So maybe this is the start of the helmet okay. of next year. Um, yeah, so the, we'll take credit in this interview. So. Exactly. <laughs> um, yeah, I, I don't know why. I, I did a helmet for Miami because we had the blue car. Yeah. I mean, we had some small touch of blue on the car, so I, I had a full blue helmet. Before that, I never really done that, but I want to implement it because it's one of my favorite colors. And add the number 16, wherever you want. Let's see the result. Let's see it. Here it is. What are your initial thoughts? I like it. I want it on the profile though. So I, I should maybe write, can you, can you show me the profile of the helmet, no? Can you show? Maybe the, can, the, the, can the side view? Can you display the side view of the helmet? That's crazy though, how, how quick everything is with AI. But I like, the helmet is already cool. You like the initial version of it? Yes. We are going to work on it. It looks cool, but there's not much baby blue on there, is there? You could argue that there's not enough baby blue. There's the inside that actually, I really like the inside baby blue like this. And this is okay. an idea that I'll probably keep. How can we change that? At the top, at the start of the prompt, maybe changing the main colors um, to start with baby blue, with, with a touch of red and white. Oh, you will say you will say the main color is the baby blue. Yeah. So, as main color, the baby 
blue and touches of red and white. So let's see, it's generating, it's generating. Oh, this is really cool. You like it? I love it. I really like this uh, because that's like a curb. This is really cool actually. If you took this to your team, could they turn this into an actual helmet? Is this, is this the first week of the process complete? Or is there, I will say there so. more steps? I'll say so, yes. I mean, I probably want a little bit less blue and a bit okay. more red and white, but I love this idea. Can I take that in picture? You can take a picture, yeah? Thank you. I'll send that straight to the team. I like it. I really like it. Happy with the final results? I, I am, I am. I'm glad that was quick. Yeah, that was very <laughs> quick, actually. That is the fastest helmet design I've ever done, but I mean, I've only got to write my thoughts and then AI makes it real in five seconds. Well, that's it. That was actually very impressive uh, to use uh, Patriarch by AWS and to see a final result in just just seconds, which is normally uh, something that takes uh, quite a bit more time. But I feel like this is a really good base to work on with my designers in order to have a finished product for for next year, which uh, I'm, I'm really happy with that. And it was, uh, yeah, so fast, so easy to use. So that's amazing. And of course, a huge thanks to AWS for supporting us on track and off the track and uh, pushing us to uh, do better at every races and supporting us. Um, and uh, yeah, we'll uh, just keep pushing for the rest of the season. Thank you very much.